On today's episode of the Rod Messinger Show, Brian Allen Jr. and Ruben Owens commit to the Longhorns. Longhorns fans, don't forget to like and subscribe. Currently, we're at about 930 subscribers at the time of this video. You can help us get to 1,000, and it'd be much appreciated. So to begin, Dylan, Brian Allen Jr., 2022 four-star safety, out of Alito, commits to the Longhorns. What stands out about him? Well, Devin, if you're a Texas fan, and obviously the program, I mean, the moment you hear a defensive player is committed, let alone the secondary, you're, you're going to be ecstatic no matter what. And this guy, he's got the build. He's the prototype safety that you want in a guy. He's big. He's strong. He's got, he's got the poundage on him. You know, he's got the weight. And he's a two, two-sport athlete as well. He was running track in high school. And he's from a winning program in, a, in Alito. They know how to win championships and have a winning culture. So he's coming from a coming from a place that, you know, they expected winning and he's, and he's done that and he's got insane speed. The only problem is it seems like he, uh, struggled with man coverage a bit, but you know, once you get to college practiced up, he'll be all set. Yeah. Man coverage might be struggling, but he's a safety. So eventually he'll get yeah. some more snaps in man. And I won't be too worried about that. He's six feet tall. As you said, he's got a good frame to build on. So not too worried there either. He's a top 15 player for the state of Texas, number 58 overall in the country. He's a good center fielder at the safety position, but he's also not afraid to play at the line of scrimmage and really just hit someone at the line. And also, he's got some good ball skills. He's played a little bit more at wide receiver this past season after Jace McClellan went to Alabama, but definitely an interesting player for the Longhorns to get. And we like to see defensive players commit to Longhorns, although now we need some beef on those lines. And the next player that committed... Texas's first player in their 2023 class, Ruben Owens, a four-star running back from El Campo. What do you think about him? I mean, that's a good guy to get to really uh, kick off that 2023 uh, recruit recruiting class, Devin, because this guy, he's got the frame, as you're saying. Both these guys are prototype builds. They're the guys you want. It's going to be able to, once he puts on pounds in college, he's going to be he's gonna be a big dude. He's going to be hard to take down. And out of the backfield, he's a really good receiving back and he knows once he gets to that second level he knows how to you know create some separation and lose the defender or he just goes through them so I think it's a huge get really good for them I agree he's got a good mix of as you said size and speed he stands in measured at about 5'11 but he looks taller on film than that and his vision he's not Jonathan Brooks shifty but he makes cuts when he needs to make them yeah. and as you said he's also in his highlights Showed off some hands, so maybe he will be a receiving threat out of the backfield as well. But then the other thing to point out, we like our stars, we like our top players. He is the second best running back in the nation, according to 24-7 sports in that 2023 class. But more importantly, he's the top player in Texas, apparently, according to 24-7 sports. So not bad. Hopefully we get to see some action out of him during his next season, but a good ad for Longhorns who continue to build and beef up that running back room. But what do you guys think? Which ad impresses you the most? Who are you most excited to see? Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great rest of your day.